Hello and welcome. I'm Tani and today I'm leading you in a total body bar workout. For this class, you're gonna need a set of weights. I recommend one to five pounds. Today I'm using threes. I also have a towel and some water because I'm expecting some sweat. So get what it is you need and let's get started. Let's get started with our warm up. Bring your feet hip distance apart, hands to the waist, all toes forward, and just start to bend and straighten into a little gentle squat. So we start to warm the body, keeping your back straight, good posture, those belly muscles pulled in. Now we're gonna start to add a releve. So give me a squat, now lift your heels. Again, squat and lift, squat and lift. Starting to introduce a little bit of balance as we lift the heels. Let's do two more, then we're gonna put that together. Now squat to a releve all together. Up, down, up, add the arms down, lift down, lift. So bigger move, you might start to feel that heart rate slowly start to climb. Two more. Now hold your squat, bring those arms forward, sink just a little bit deeper. Maybe that weight shifts back a little bit to the heels. Holding here, you're gonna give me a squat with a right knee lift. So squat, right knee, squat, right knee. Staying right here on this side. Little bit more balance work as the knee lifts. Two more. Now hold that knee up, find balance, arms over the head. Hold here, point that toe, keep holding, find that balance. Now lunge out to the side and hold. So the toes may be more to 45 degrees, but behind you, step to the squat. Lunge and squat, keep going. Lunge and squat. Lunge and squat. Four. Last two. And then we're just gonna change the count. Hold the lunge, lateral lunge, three, two, one, together. Arms, three, two, one, together. Watch, three, two, one, together. Adding that rotation. This class has quite a bit of core work. Work in that midsection. So we wanna be sure it's all nice and warmed, ready to go. Keep those arms extended out wide. Now hold this lateral lunge. Turn the toes out for a warrior two position. Lean forward and over and lift up. Feel that stretch and lift. Stretch, squeeze, lift up. Keep it going. Legs are strong. Two and one. Bend that elbow and take it into that side body stretch. Lengthen it out. Lift up. Start to squat, down and up, down and up. Add the left knee, down and lift. Point that toe, lift up tall, good. Now, hold that knee up, balance, reach the arms up over your head. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. Get ready. Step it wide and hold that lateral lunge. Find it, make any adjustments for your feet you need to. Come up and squat. Lateral lunge. 
up and squat. Again, lunge and squat. Keep that back straight. Booty drops back. Now hold three, three, two, one, and up. Changing those arms, three, two, one, lift up. So as we go through this warm up, the moves become bigger. Heart rate coming up, body temperature coming up. Let's go. Two more. Last one. Step it wide and hold. Adjust the toes straight forward. Lean it over. Come down and lift up. Like an angle pose in yoga to warrior two. Over and up. Feel those obliques working. Keep that front knee bent. You got it, two more. Bring it down and hold. Bend that elbow, place it on the thigh and extend and reach. And come up. All right, finishing up our warm up. Move to the short end of your mat. Reach the arms over your head, fold forward. Walk out to a high plank. So shoulders over wrist. Take that right knee, see if you can tap the right elbow or tricep, put it back. Switch sides, left and back, right and left. Stay strong. Four to go. Four, three, two. Drop the knee, sit back into extended child's pose. Find a nice stretch. Keeping the knees on the mat, come back forward into a supported plank position. So the body's at a diagonal, then the elbows push up, down and up. Back straight, eyes slightly forward on your mat. Push it back, child's pose. Come forward, downward facing dog. Hips up, chest back, find that stretch. Heels reaching for the mat. Come back forward to that high plank. Roll to your right side, side plank, and to plank. Now the other side, lift and down, lift and down. Bottom knee could find the mat if you need support. One more time each side. Hold here. Knees to the mat, push it up, down, push up, down, push up. Elbows are towards your rib cage, bending back behind you towards the waist. Push it up. Three to go. Three, two, and one. Sit it back, child's pose. Hopefully you are now totally warm. Hold here. Come forward, find downward facing dog. Walk your hands backwards. Let's take a stretch in forward fold. Move whatever you need to do. Roll it up nice and slow. One vertebrae at a time. Let's go, pick up your weights. Told you I need to wipe the sweat. Picking up the weights, we're gonna meet in a First position, <laughs> take the heels in, toes out. Start to bend and straighten the knees. Bend and straighten. So full range of motion here. Back is straight. 
Start to add a bicep curl, a hammer curl, so your palms are in. Arms continue. The legs come half range motion. So it's down halfway up. So we keep the tension in the muscles. We keep those knees slightly bent throughout. Deeper, lift, deeper, lift. Really start to notice your glutes here. That mind muscle connection. Stay focused right here on our workout. Now, hold it down in that down position. Arms at 90 degrees, pulse the legs. Now, knees bent, come on down. Heels are still connected to the mat, hammer, curl. Eight, let's go. Isometric hold for the low body. Upper body working. Good. Let's come down and up, down and up. We are gonna start to add a hip hinge. So come into your plie, down and up. Bend, hip hinge and up. It's a small hip hinge. Shoulders back. Pull the weights by your sides. As you hinge forward, tricep kick back. There you go. Down, hinge, kick back, and up. Down. Last one. Come down, hinge forward, only arms right here. Pull those arms back, rotate the palms up, pulse it up behind you, lift up, up, up. Hold it up, palms face in, like you're clapping behind your back. Here we go, clap, 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 pulse it in, let's go. Knees bent, yes you can, you got it. There's eight, seven. Pick it up, we come into second position, our plie. Toes turned out, down and front raise, down and front. So we always start out here with that full range of motion. Be sure you're nice and wide, knees over the ankles, keep going. Now, same thing with the arms, half range with the legs. Start to really keep tension in those muscles. Keep that front raise going. We'll change it here in a minute. Pulse it right here. Now nice and slow, as you pulse, you just start to lift and lower the arms to that lateral raise. Keep pulsing with those legs. Now freeze the legs, eight single lateral raises, lift. Stay low in those legs, you've got this. You've got it, you are strong. Bring the weights up to the shoulders, down and up, down and up. So remember that three count that we did in the warm up? Let's try it here, hold. Three, two, one, and lift. Watch a change. Three, two, one. Other side, join me. Now you can stay here or you can take that weight down to the outside of the knee as you lean over. Three, two, one, and up. Three. Almost there, keep going. Two, 
Two more. You got it. Good, keep those weights right here at the shoulders. Lift that right heel up, 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 and switch. Left, three, two, one, and switch, go. And switch, you got it. Four more sets, and switch. And switch, yes you can, yes you can and release, put the weights down, stay in that second position. Down, lift up, down, lift up. So in my bar classes, I usually put in a short cardio burst. Start to lift your heels, lift, lift. Now you never have to leave the ground if you don't want to, but if you wish, add it 10 times, 10, nine, Two more, and break. Nice job. Take that break, at least I need it. We're gonna be moving on down to the mat. Keep those weights close though. All right, quick drink of water, and we're moving on down to the floor. We're gonna start at the short end of your mat. So you can walk out just like we did in that warm up. I try to introduce as much as I can in that warm up. Reach it up, forward fold, walk it out. Now we're gonna keep our knees up the best we can. Take your right arm nice and wide. Give me eight push ups, down and up. Back straight. Come back to the center. Drop to your forearms, forearm plank. Up to high plank. Left hand goes wide. Give me those push-ups. Down and up, down and up. It's okay if you're not with me. Just do your best. If you're moving, you are successful because you're doing it. Hands come back, drop to that forearm plank. You've got this, hold it. And release, flipping it over onto our backs. You're gonna need your weights for this. We're gonna take it on down into our backs. We're gonna do a bridge series. So knees bent, bring your heels down <clears throat> and your heels are close to your glutes. Arms overhead, weights pressing together. Take the weights over your head and lift up. Over and lift. Start to notice your midsection. Engage your ab muscles. Press the belly down into the mat. Keep that engagement. Hold the arms over the head, lift your hips. From here, you're gonna take the arms over and lift up. The lower body matches it. Lower, squeeze up. Lower, squeeze up. Hold in that up position. Extend your left leg out. Knees are in line, hips are lifted. We're gonna do our best to keep in that lifted position. Reach your arms over your head, kick the leg up and the weights come up. Down and lift. The hips are lifted the whole time. Those core muscles nice and strong. Everything working here, glutes, hams, Abs, arms, let's go. Point that toe. You are strong. Lift. Lift. Two more. Hold. Switch sides. Extend that leg out at a diagonal.
Take the arms out. Now lift everything up. One. Let's go. Two. Hips are up. You can do this. Belly in. Let's go. Three, two, and one. Hips up. Press it up. Bring your heels, the insides of your feet together. Keep lifting. Knees open and close. Open. Think those clams, right, that we do on the floor sometimes. Now widen the arms. Lift up. Inner and outer thigh work, glutes, let's go. Don't stop. Really think about it, squeeze. Hips up, last four, three, and lower it down to the mat, nice job. Place the weights down, interlace those hands behind the head, lift the shoulders, extend left leg out. Arms over the head, hold, switch sides, hands back to the head, extend, belly presses down, arms out, and in, extend both legs, extend both arms, hover, knees into chest, good, place the hands, the feet down, excuse me, hands behind the head, start to crunch, and lift, and lower. Both knees over the hips. Hold in that up position. Extend left leg. Extend right leg. Lift. Isometric hold, shoulders up, eyes to the ceiling. Careful not to pull on that neck. Bicycle, go. Come on, finish strong, finish strong. 10, 9, 8, 4, 3, smile, 2, and 1, and knees to chest. Awesome job. Rock it up, extend those legs out in front of you, reach it up, exhale it over, stretch it out. Hamstring stretch. Begin to roll it down, nice and slow. Cross that right ankle above the left knee, reach through, stretch into those hips. Switch sides. So you did an amazing job. I'm gonna recommend that you drink a lot of water, not just today, but uh, every day, get that in. Super good for your body. Take the feet to the edges of your mat, knees bent, arms come into goal posts. We're just gonna do a passive stretch here. And then just drop your knees side to side. Just opens up the chest. Those shoulders, and obviously uh, getting into that spine, releasing the back. Now come to one side, help yourself up to have a seat. Reach the arms up, take that right hand to the center of the back, tricep stretch. So we got everything in, total body, got you in just a little bit of cardio. I know I worked up a sweat. Good, interlace those hands behind you, or if that doesn't work, just grab your elbows, something to open up the front of the body. One deep breath in, exhale it out. Give yourself a great job, you did it. You did amazing. Thank you so much for joining me for class. Hopefully you'll join me again soon.